I didn't think suicide would affect my family. My father, Dave, Steve, Atif, my little brother, has missed so much. The birthdays, the holidays, his weddings, anniversaries, the simple moments, just watching TV or laughing together. He was a huge Philadelphia sports fan, and we had season tickets together, and we would always joke, wondering if we would be alive to see them win a championship. Unfortunately, he wasn't. But when I went to the parade, I made sure to bring him with me, with his ashes, and got this tattoo so that he would always be with me. My father and I used to run Spartan races together, and there is something very missed about not having him standing at the finish line when I complete my race. The thing that breaks my heart the most is that he never got to have full conversations with his daughter. He died when she was so young. He didn't get to see her graduate and go to one of the top high schools in the state. These are moments that are supposed to be happy and joyous, moments we've been waiting a lifetime for. You will know, always be a piece missing. I, I didn't, didn't think that this would happen to me. Suicide is the 10th leading cause of death in the United States. But we know that it can be preventable. You can make a difference. Most people who attempt to take their own life will exhibit one or more warning signs. Either through what they say or what they do. If you or someone you know is struggling, please reach out and have an honest conversation in private. Tell them you care about them. Ask directly if they're thinking about suicide. Encourage them to seek treatment or to contact their doctor or therapist. Avoid debating the value of life. And minimizing their problems or giving advice. If you are struggling, please remember to reach out. You, you are, not, are alone. not alone.